So, a few days ago, Biden gives a press conference. He gets directly asked by a reporter about the polls where a large plurality of voters from all directions of the political compass have expressed significant doubt in his mental fitness to continue in office. And he kind of brushed it off, and then it obviously disturbed him. And then another question that he was asked by another reporter caused him to ramble into territory where he was about this close from being like, you know what, I'm not mentally fit. But he can't admit it because that's part of the thing. But they got him cornered. They did this live. Everyone needs to see it. If you haven't seen it, it's a real thing. He's... Uh, 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 uh. And everything he's trying to speak on is very generalized terms as he tries to backstep and walk himself into some place that he can remember, but he can't remember because it's dementia. Simultaneously, Russia's already in Crimea. Crimea. They're going to be moving further into Crimea. Biden was like, well, we'll take military steps if anything's serious. And it's like, no, dude, you're not in a position to do anything right now with that. And the military is weakened because of this woke bullshit, which means a lot of soldiers are out of the military when their time ran out or they got released on an honorable discharge because they refused to take a fucking particular medical procedure, which is now being proven pretty conclusively not to do shit. And we'll get into y'all that got conned into taking that at another point. But first and foremost, China is also now, I believe as of today or yesterday, flying jets through Taiwanese airspace. And we are not in a position to defend Taiwan which means two countries with interests that counter ours are going to be taking territory that affects our economy. This will lead to a hot World War III. And I don't think we're going to win it. So, if you voted for Joe Biden, it's time to seriously figure out how you're going to end yourself and take yourself out of this world because we don't want you here. We don't need you here. If you're that fucking stupid, you're going to keep endangering the rest of us. Take yourself out. And the moment World War III sparks up a hot battle, it is literally open season on Biden voters here in America. Because we must cleanse the country of such stupidity before we can move on and rebuild. But we're not going to build it back better. We're going to have America be America. The only way to do that is to get rid of stupid people and make sure that all the communists are the good kind.